uh, snakes down smash with anything? Run up shield. That's Run up shield and roll through him. Yeah. That's, right, that's, that's universal. Alright, Bob, good news going under his platform. Looks like a platform. Yeah, I'll be up. Oh man, I haven't eaten all day today. Yeah. I ate like a fistful of jelly beans, I think, is what I ate today. That doesn't sound very appetizing. Oh, well, I mean, not at, not at once. You put, you take your fistful and you pick out the good ones, you know what I mean? Then you pick out some bad ones and you kind of go one by one. All of the jelly beans are bad ones. What? All right. Okay. All right, We're so going to is uh, getting center stage. Nice. I was expecting him to get uh, under that platform. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like I this. know. <laughs> this, this is the, this that's is like it. This, this is it right here. That's the noosh zone. <gasps> and also notice that Baba Ganoush always takes port four. And you know why, right? I have no idea why. Okay. Port priority on Snake basically means that when you're being grabbed, right? The person in the lower port he gets is put into... It, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, first player will get hit by the grenade. Oh, nice. And then fourth player will be put into grab release animation. Yeah, okay. That's why I fixed part. So whenever you want to play... Whenever you play against Baba Ganoush, always try to sneak in that port four. Oh, yeah, yeah. Now he's going above the platforms. Kind of bad. Oh... I, don't, I think that punish could have been a lot better. Yeah, it was kind of small. When he gets in, he really needs to uh, capitalize. Yeah. See right there, that spaced backer. I felt like if he if he kind of faded in a little more. Yeah, it would have. It, it would have been a lot pressure. more passive pressure. Yeah. See right there, run up shield. That's how he's doing it. Ooh, that was yeah. Red Ranger r rolled back because he wasn't sure if that dash tag was gonna cross up or not. Right, right, right. But he was he was in ring for. Ooh, the retreating forward. That's good. Oh, oh man, Ganon, when he sleeps, he'll sleep super lazy looking. Oh! Ooh, that's right. one way to get around right. him. Oh my god! Down to him, down to him now! No! That was. Oh, um. Trade. Um, okay. Uh, that works, yeah. They're just thinking about it. Right. Wowee. Bob Grenier's trying to air camp here. Get too aggressive on Snake Shield. Or. Oh my gosh. Uh, Baba Ganesh is trying to regain that shield. Yeah. Snake plays in shield a lot. Just because, like, the way you. Oh, nice. Nice read there. Uh, again, these punishes aren't, uh, aren't as strong as he needs them to be. Yeah. Snake is kind of a weird weight where you can't get chain grab too hard, you know? So. Ganon's gonna have to end it really, really early with those forwarders and backers. Mm, you could also go for a lot more uh, regrabs. Re yeah, like uh, platform tech, tech chase. B, yeah. Mm, oh like yeah, that. that's right. Because forward B is a reset. Yeah, because you. Oh, that's right. You could jump, double jump, forward B. Man, there's a lot of. There's actually more dimensions again than the one that I know. Because <laughs> yeah. when I play my game, and I just down throw, down throw forward air when they squeeze out. Yeah, forward air is probably the safer option, but if you're behind, you need to be taking these risks. Get yeah, more damage out. That's true. Ooh, okay. I like the B-reverse pluck. Uh, that's with like bomb? with with a grenade, because really, that's the... Yeah, really good aerial movement. Because mm -hmm. Snake it doesn't have very much aerial moment mobility right. otherwise. Uh -oh. Ooh, that was really... That needed to be more delicate. I don't know, actually, because like he he punches above him, you know? So he has to extend his hurt box above the lift. I'm not sure if he was able to sweet spot uh, that. Yeah, maybe... Uh, okay. We'll see. We'll be we'll definitely be able there's, to see yeah, by the end gonna, of Yeah, there's going to be a lot more situations like that. Yeah. Here we go, back air, right? Oh, uh, goes, goes for the up air. air. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, the up air gimp will send Snake at a really bad angle, but I think back air would have... Uh, been sufficient. Yeah. Also, it would have been able to poke under the cipher because what happened was that the cipher hit him in the in the in the calf. Yeah. No, not calf. The Human humans. What is this part? Of the quad set? Thigh. Thigh. A thigh. I guess. Yeah. yeah. Thigh. Humans have calves. I know, but I mean, like, that's not where the calf is located. I wanted to be like super accurate on like where the positioning of that hitbox was. And shit. Snake's a human. I mean, Ganon's a human. No. I don't know. Yeah, I don't think uh, Baba Ganesh wants to ban the big stages here. Yeah. FD. This is awkward because it actually minimizes Ganon's punish game. I know that Red Ranger loves FD. Red Ranger loves FD. I've always found that literally the most questionable thing yeah, in all of SoCal Smash. Yeah. The fact the that this guy loves FD. <laughs> and he hates the big stages against characters where he's supposed to be really good on big stages. <laughs> That's but it's working. Yeah, I mean, he's getting... <laughs> it's helping his punish. I guess. <laughs> it's, that's so weird. Maybe because Baba Ganoush is more hesitant to jump. 
because there's no platforms to retreat to. Sure. Maybe it's a mental thing. I, I do remember that there was a set at a long time ago at an SSS. It was um, Red Ranger versus B Baba Ganoush was called Boss back then. Right, His right. Lucas got chain grabbed to smithereens on this stage. Yeah. Another thing um, Snake, or at least Baba Ganoush, really likes to do is use the platforms for cover. Like, he's going to do a lot of mm -hmm. air camping with double jump grenades, double jump down Bs. Yeah, especially reversing his, his momentum with the double jump and the, and the grenade puck. Yep. This, re this stage really limits his uh, options for landing, and it really limits his um, his cover when he's hiding under the platforms as well. That's true. He's more exposed. Sure. He's still a close match, but uh, Red Ranger is ahead on this stage. This is his stage. Mm -hmm. If he's not gonna win here, he's probably going to have a lot of trouble winning anywhere else. Yeah. Ooh, wow, that you see was, that? Because uh, you, whenever you get stuck, you're like, okay, right. I don't have to worry about that until late, like late percent. Right, right. So he'll sneak those in every once in a while. I wonder if he was aware he was stuck. He really, he was just standing there, mm. not even covering that Austin. There we go. And the important thing when, when Ganon does that follow-up, you DI behind, you have to adjust your DI immediately. Otherwise, you're going to catch the bear bad DI as well. All right, Baba Ganoush sneaks a lead. Ooh. Yeah, when you, when, when you have invincibility, it's okay to go for the sort of ballsy moves yeah. like that, just like a Dacus. You're invincible at the end of it, so no big deal. I mean, it's a really, really hard punish. I, I think that would have killed him at that point. Yeah, for sure. Ooh, there we go. nice. Catches the jump. Well, no tech is a good tech, tech option. Yeah. Let's see if he continues to do that and Jason catches up. Yeah. Oh, wait. He hit the bomb with his fist and it didn't explode? Uh, with the Ganondorf jab? Yeah. Or the Ganondorf fair. That was really weird looking. Maybe it's stale. <laughs> it's stale. So stale. It it's so stale they can't even hit a grenade. That was a very important sweet spot. <laughs> oh, my God. Run up shield, man. Also, Red Ranger, and you you've, you experienced this firsthand. As a Ganondorf player, I feel like he navigates through projectiles so well. Yeah. You yeah, know? The best projectile navigator I've ever seen in a Ganondorf I know. He, he, doesn't get, he doesn't get caught by a lot of stuff. He doesn't fall for really, really easy pressure. Yeah. And uh, he'll, and like, if you, like, whenever I throw a projectile at Red Ranger, I feel like I'm losing because I'm losing stage positioning. You lose stage positioning. And he's really, really, really good at... Power baiting you, well, not that, but uh, what I'm saying, baiting you into a position where if you shoot a projectile, you have no work. Oh, he's, he's going to, uh, he's going to punish it. Mm. He's really good at navigating that, uh, that range, where yeah. you really can't shoot a projectile. And sometimes you'll want to test it and say he won't punish me here. He's not that familiar, but he is. <laughs> but he is. But he is. He is a familiar. All right, last talk. Red Ranger might Red might lose his game in the set. A little bit of a to catch up on. Oh my gosh. He keeps on running up to uh, Bob Ganusha's shield. He needs to be really uh, aware of those grenades. Oh, wow. Here's so does Bob Ganoush. He goes for a risky grab there. Bob Ganoush escapes to the air. Uh -oh, uh oh, there it is. There's a stick. Oh, nice match. This is a chance. He misses the read. Oh, catches the end of the roll. Uh oh. Okay, that's fine. Uh, no, that's it. Very, that's it. Very oh, missed space. Yeah, there's still a chance here. He no, did he not see it? There's no uh, way. He he, he might have mistimed the shield. Oh, it looked like, yeah, that, it yeah, looked yeah, like yeah, yeah. You're right. Because you he overcompensated there by fielding really early. <laughs> also, the fact that you never really see Ganondorf run for that long of a right, time unless right. there's a plan. All right, this is where we <laughs> let's we see, see if Red, Red Ranger, Ranger navigates through these projectiles. Yeah, he has three minutes. He can be a little bit patient. Mm -hmm. uh Oh. He needs maybe oh. two or three good reads in a row. I think so. For one opening. It should start. Oh no. Oh no. That was a oh, good It was very scary to go above him right there yeah. because uh, he had no double jump. He had the float though. <gasps> oh, that, that's a C4. I thought that was a, a mine. He's so okay, patient with okay. this. Oh, and just as I say that he jumps. Stay ground to Jason. Uh oh. That was really close. That was. Oh, 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 oh I thought that was a back oh, air. That's, that's it. it. Man, Noosh takes it too. Oh. He uh, might have jumped a little bit too much there. Stay grounded, stay in your shield. You I think that minutes. snake jumped a lot too. 